this video, I'm going to show you a defense that I've really become a huge fan of. This defense is phenomenal for the bunch tight end. I'm going to talk about it. We're going to do a real quick video on this. If you want a more expanded version of this defense, it's in my Patreon. My Patreon is going to be linked in the description below. For just $10 a month, you'll be able to get access to every Madden 22 video exclusive tip. I've done a lot of exclusive tips this last week. Uh, we've got 13 offensive and defensive ebooks available to you as soon as you join the Patreon. So I would encourage you to check that out. There's a link in the description below where you can take a look at all that. But I really like this defense against PA boot over primarily. And it's out of the nickel triple. You can find this in the Chicago Bears defensive playbook. It's also in the Baltimore playbook and the Steelers playbook and the Jaguars, I believe. Uh, but you can, you, I like this out of Chicago, Baltimore, or Pittsburgh. Um, and the play that we're going to talk about today is cover two man. Uh, you could actually do this out of any of the cover two, uh, cover Tampa two, any of those uh, shells. But basically what we're going to do here is we're just going to simply show blitz. And then we're going to take this. Uh, safety that comes down on the tight end side and we're gonna put uh, we're gonna blitz him and then what I like to do is go ahead and QB contain and I'm gonna slide him in just a little bit so that he is off of the contain as you can see right there and then the last but not least we know from kind of experience that when people run PA boot over typically the running backs not gonna be on a route so I'm gonna go ahead and globally blitz my linebackers and then I'm going to bring this safety down in the box, and I'm going to man him up on the tight end just in case that tight end goes on a route. And I'm going to kind of stand like right here, okay? I'm going to stand kind of right in here. I like to have contains on both edges here. And what you're going to see here is I'm going to go ahead and set this uh, PA boot over play up. And at the snap of the ball, I'm going to kind of run down, and then I'm going to work, look to kind of take care of the routes. Now, every route on this play, uh, it should get jammed at the snap. So you'll see right here, we get a nice jam. And then the quarterback's going to roll right into pressure. Now, the pressure does not always come in 100% completely free every time. They are blocking seven, and we are only sending six. Um, or actually, I think, te yeah, technically we're sending six. Um, but the thing that I wanted to really emphasize, though, is he's never, ever, ever going to be able to get out of the pocket with, this, with the way that these uh, contains are going to work. If you wanted a little bit simpler of a setup, if you just blitz that safety and QB contain, for the most part, that will work. Um, what I would what I would suggest doing in that regard, I still would bring this guy down. I really think that helps a lot in this defense. Um, the way that I like to run the nickel triple, and then if you wanted to, you could do something like that. Um, the one thing that you might need to do is individually move that corner over there over the top of the number, uh, over the top of. Uh, Chris Godwin and get a kind of an individual jam uh, something that I'm really really starting to enjoy in this game but anyways uh, the bottom line is here if they, if they send that tight end on a route you're going to get an instant sack every time um, you're literally the pressure is going to absolutely scream but the other thing that I like about this here you'll see you see how good the contain is right there right very good he can't get out of the pocket he's gonna have to sit in that pressure sit in all that congestion and try to make a read so then what you're gonna get um, typically is you're gonna get something that essentially looks you know kind of like like this right they're gonna you know maybe block their tight end or they're gonna send him on a route there because the reason they're gonna send him on a route is because you know you're kind of in a situation where now you've kind of put them in a situation where they have to kind of adapt to your defense which is what the nickel triple um, is all about it's why I really like this defense a lot uh, but anyway so so now you're gonna have this look right here and they might send this guy on a route well, you still have really, really good coverage uh, with this defense. It's just a five-man pressure if you don't want to blitz this linebacker. You don't have to blitz that linebacker. I like to sometimes just leave him manned up on the running back, honestly, and it's going to be fine. So I like to man this guy up on the running back, bring high down. We're going to put him in man coverage on that tight end. And then uh, my recommendation would be to individually kind of press uh, all of these slots. Just gives you a better jam. Uh, animation and then you're going to be kind of hovering right here it's kind of a cover one defense if you will you're the rat in the hole you're going to be using over the middle anything that you see typically what i'm looking for is a post route or a crossing route that's kind of what i'm going to look for with my user here uh, but anyways if they run it like this now what you should see is we should have a pretty good chance of getting an instant sack as you can see right there we get that instant sack at the quarterback so that's one of the things that i really like about the nickel triple and i'm looking to kind of expand on this concept a little bit more in my patreon so if you want to learn everything about the nickel triple defense or if you just want to take your madden game to the next level be sure to join the patreon there's a link in the description of this video you can join for just 10 bucks and i guarantee you you're going to get your value back in about five minutes of just being in the patreon because we have 13 ebooks i've released 
several uh, massive updates to all the ebooks this week or several of the defenses specifically i've been working a lot on the defensive side of the ball i've got great stuff on offense as well we've got trips tied in trio white flags bunch bunch tied in spread uh the air raid um, so we've got more stuff coming on offense as well, but I really, really think that you should check out this nickel triple defense. So if you're interested and you're still watching the video, head on down to the description and click that link. You can go check out the Patreon and uh, check out this defense. Thanks for watching.